Hi there, welcome to Rumor Spill. Samuel L. Jackson, a venerable figure in the world of cinema, stands not only as a paragon of acting excellence, but also as a steadfast advocate for the empowerment of the black community in Hollywood. His journey is a testament to his unwavering commitment to championing the rights and representation of black artists in an industry often marred by inequality. Recently, Jackson has brought attention to a concerning trend among some black celebrities, sparking a crucial dialogue on the portrayal of black individuals in popular culture. Jackson's critique, particularly directed toward Steve Harvey and Tiffany Haddish, stems from his belief that their portrayals in certain roles contribute to perpetuating negative stereotypes about black people. These comments are not mere offhand remarks, but form part of a deeper, ongoing conversation about the role and responsibilities of black artists in the media. The historical tension between Jackson and Harvey adds a layer of complexity to this critique. Beyond their personal dynamics, Jackson's concerns resonate with those of other prominent figures in the black entertainment community, such as Cat Williams. These artists argue that the work of some black entertainers, rather than dismantling barriers, might actually reinforce detrimental stereotypes. The issue was further highlighted following Taraji P. Henson's candid revelations about racial bias in the film industry. Her experiences brought to light the broader challenges black actors face in Hollywood, including the types of roles and representations offered to them. These revelations have prompted a probing of the responsibility that black celebrities have in shaping public perceptions through their art. As a respected actor and influential figure in the black community, Jackson's insights on race and representation carry significant weight. His activism, grounded in a long-standing commitment to racial equality, adds credibility to his opinions on these matters. The historical backdrop of his feud with Harvey, dating back to their shared past with Bernie Mac, adds further depth to his critique. This history serves as a reminder of the intricate web of personal and professional relationships within the black entertainment industry. The contrast in comedic styles between Bernie Mac and Steve Harvey is indicative of the diversity within the black comedy community. Mac's approach, characterized by a seamless blend of audience engagement and professionalism, contrasts sharply with Harvey's style, which some have criticized for potentially alienating audiences. This contrast highlights the varied paths black comedians navigate in their careers and public personas. Williams' critique of Harvey delves into the broader issue of the portrayal of black men in Hollywood. He voices concerns about the industry's tendency to demean and emasculate black male artists, a trend he finds deeply troubling. This criticism points to a larger conversation about the choices black artists make and the impact of those choices on community representation and public perception. Harvey's controversial opinions on relationships and morality have added layers of complexity to his public persona. His statements on these topics have sparked debate about perpetuating harmful ideologies and stereotypes. These comments have ignited discussions about the influence and responsibility of public figures in shaping societal norms and values. Tiffany Haddish's career trajectory in Hollywood is equally complex and multifaceted. Her behavior at public events, particularly the VMAs, has been scrutinized for perpetuating negative stereotypes about black women. The public's reaction to her actions underscores the delicate balance black entertainers must strike between personal expression and the broader implications of their public image. Haddish's journey is one of both remarkable triumphs and intense scrutiny. Her Emmy win for her guest appearance on Saturday Night Live was a significant achievement, yet it also opened up a conversation about the need for more racial diversity and representation in award ceremonies. This situation highlights the unique challenges black entertainers often face in navigating personal success against the backdrop of broader industry-wide issues. Williams' critique of Haddish brings into focus the authenticity and struggles of black comedic talent in Hollywood. He suggests that her rise to fame is more reflective of industry favoritism than her comedic skills, highlighting the role of race and colorism in the recognition and success of black artists. This perspective adds a critical dimension to the discourse about the barriers black comedians, especially women, face in being recognized for their unique talents and contributions. Amid her professional highs, Haddish found herself embroiled in a controversy that stirred significant backlash 
and raise questions about the boundaries of comedy and ethical responsibility. The incident involving a comedy sketch with children and the subsequent legal ramifications brought to the forefront serious considerations about the responsibilities of entertainers in their creative expressions. Although the lawsuit was eventually dismissed, the incident left a lasting impact on Haddish's public image and career trajectory. Despite these challenges, Haddish's ability to maintain a significant presence in the industry is noteworthy. Her resilience in the face of adversity underscores her strength as an entertainer and highlights her adaptability within the complex landscape of Hollywood. In stark contrast to the controversy surrounding Harvey and Haddish, Samuel L. Jackson's role in Hollywood and his approach to these issues tell a different story. Celebrated for his nuanced performances and deep commitment to challenging racial stereotypes, Jackson stands as a bastion of integrity in the entertainment world. His efforts to portray complex black characters are an essential part of the larger struggle for racial equality and authentic representation. Jackson's activism is deeply embedded in both his professional work and personal experiences. His involvement in the black rights movement and commitment to social causes have solidified his status as a key advocate for racial justice. His portrayal of characters like Abel Turner in Lakeview Terrace showcases his dedication to presenting multi-dimensional black characters moving beyond simplistic or negative stereotypes. Jackson's personal encounters with racial profiling, such as the unsettling incident during the filming of Pulp Fiction, serve as poignant reminders of the ongoing issues of racism in America. These experiences have informed his advocacy for change, both within the entertainment industry and in broader societal contexts. His challenges to Harvey and Haddish are part of his broader call for accountability and conscious representation among black celebrities. Jackson urges them to reflect on the impact of their public personas and artistic choices and how these might inadvertently perpetuate harmful stereotypes. Despite his influential voice, the allure of Hollywood fame and the complexities of the industry present formidable challenges to enacting substantive change. The public discourse around these celebrities is layered and multifaceted. While some criticize Harvey and Haddish for allegedly reinforcing stereotypes, others acknowledge their accomplishments and their roles in advancing the representation of black artists in entertainment. This dichotomy reflects the ongoing challenge of defining identity, representation, and success within the dynamic landscape of entertainment. Hollywood's portrayal of black artists has always been a topic of intense debate. The industry, historically dominated by a narrative that does not always favor diversity and inclusion, has been slow to change. This backdrop makes the roles chosen by black artists like Harvey and Haddish particularly significant. Their decisions not only impact their careers, but also contribute to shaping the narrative around black identity and culture in mainstream media. In recent years, there has been a growing awareness and critique of how Hollywood stereotypes black people. The conversation has shifted from mere representation to the quality and depth of that representation. It's no longer just about having black faces on screen, but about the stories being told and the characters being portrayed. Jackson, through his career and activism, has been a vocal proponent of this shift, advocating for roles that offer a more authentic and varied portrayal of black life. Meanwhile, Harvey's journey in the industry has been a blend of significant successes and controversies. His journey from a stand-up comedian to a multifaceted entertainer is a testament to his talent and resilience. However, his often polarizing views and the roles he chooses have sparked debate about the responsibility of entertainers in influencing public perception and cultural narratives. Haddish's path has been marked by a meteoric rise to fame, punctuated by moments of both acclaim and criticism. Her ability to navigate the complex dynamics of Hollywood, coupled with her undeniable talent, has made her a prominent figure in the industry. Yet, the controversies she's been involved in raise important questions about the impact of celebrity actions and the broader implications for the community they represent. As the entertainment industry continues to evolve, the roles and responsibilities of black artists like Jackson, Harvey, and Haddish remain critical. Their choices, both on and off the screen, have the power to influence perceptions, shape cultural narratives, and pave the way for future generations of black artists. 
The conversation around their actions and the impact of their work is an ongoing and vital part of the broader discourse on race, representation, and equality in Hollywood. Subscribe Rumor Spill for more videos.